everyone, my name is Dai Excel, your Excel Sifu from YXL. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a project I'm working on to show you how easy can Excel help us to improve our working life. In the QC environment, that means in the quality control environment, it will have a date and the model, the reason why of the rejection and the quantity of the amount rejected. Usually people will use paper and pen start jotting down or they can use Excel form something like this by doing a data entry again and again. This kind of data entry is counterintuitive especially the QC, the quality control personnel is working on the workstation with a limited space for the computer. By using Excel alone, we can combine this kind of situation and show it on the screen by using a touchpad something like this. They can see this screen without worrying about the data behind it. So what they can do, you can just clean the model number is alpha 1. I currently I clean all in small letter as and when I move away, it turns everything into uppercase. Now this is the first batch and I do some changes and checking and I notice I have 5 quantity has passed this test. So I press 5. I can see the result show on the screen is a 5 quantity and the result is passed and the date and time I submitted for the model alpha 1. When I realize I have some mistakes or some defects I need to reject. So machine, it has a uh, some fiber dust. So I click, it will show or oh, how many quantity I realize. I realize at this point of time it has two. I just click two, it just submitted. And subsequently I realized I have the same thing again, fiber dust as reject. So now it's a one. So as and when I click submission, it has a date and a time appears on the screen. When I go to other category, it could do the same thing as well. Now, it has something called overspray because of the category of spray, the reason. So I click overspray, it will ask me again. Overspray, currently I have, oh, I make a mistake. I can cancel, I can go back. It's not overspray because of the color. So I click, it will show. Now it's a one quantity. I click, it will show the date and the time when I submitted the report. This makes the whole thing easier. And what you can see on the screen, at this moment, it has a lot of blank button. It says future. That means with a slight hit tweak, this file is much more easier to extend for the future matches. And currently, it only has so many categories they can extend it by using Excel changes without need to worry about the consistency and the usability of the file. If I extend to some other category, you can see the same thing as well. This is what Excel can do for you to make your life way, way easier. And hopefully this can inspire you what Excel could do for you. And my name is Star Excel, your Excel Sifu from YXL.